Winter is in full effect here at Algonquin College, and with it come many unpleasantries that us as Ottawa citizens need to put up with, such as giant snowbanks on sidewalks, frigid weather, and freezing rain. But there's one unpleasantry in particular that is hurting the egos and wallets of Ottawa students, salty boots. Rather than succumbing to the pressures of mother nature and letting the entire city turn into one giant skating rink, we as residents choose to coat the surface of our city in a heavy sprinkling of salt. And whether you step in a pile of salt or walk in one of the slushy saltwater oceans that cover Algonquin's parking lots, no winter footwear seems immune to the devastating effects of salt. Just a quick look down and it's easy to see that the Salty Boots pandemic is widespread across all types of students. The corrosive salt coats footwear in any color in a chalky white mess and over time wears through fabrics, dooming any Ottawa footwear to a short lifespan of just one winter season. A good pair of winter boots can cost upwards of $200 and it is just not in the budget for many students who are already strapped for cash. I stopped in at the Aldo Shoe Store in College Square to see if these shoe experts had any advice for extending the lifespan of our footwear during this grueling season. People can use vinegar-based wipes, which are like a natural alternative to chemical-based cleaners. You can use chemical-based cleaners, which won't have any other real adverse effects on your shoes. Um, and you can also use lotions and other types of uh, cleaners to kind of rehydrate your leather or your suede or new buck shoes to give them like a new look. Well, there you have it. By spending a little bit more time and money on your shoes, you may be able to wear them in February of 2016. Shannon Castledine, The Weekly.